Let's just sneak on now. God damn it. Well, everybody mount up. We still going through with this? Of course we are.
John. I tried. I tried. He didn't make it. That patrol killed him. We had to run. Come on. Let's go. Before another patrol turns up. We gotta let her go. John's, uh, well, sorry, son. Without John, she's just bait. We got a bunch of money, Dutch. She's just a girl. They won't do nothing to her. But me and the boys know. Yep. We need to keep riding on this one, Dutch. You know it. Every man here knows so we it. we just gonna let the boy be made an orphan? It ain't like that. What is it like? I wanna live, cowpoke. I still got the choice. Dutch, it's just a girl. You're right. Dutch, Micah. It pains me to say it, Arthur. But he's right. Dutch! Come on, boys. Yeah. Well, I guess that's that, then. All them goddamn years. Come on, Arthur. Let's go get her. You and me is all we need. Miss Tilly. Here. Take this. <clears throat> you take this money, too. Take Jack, and you wait at Copperhead Landing for Abigail and Mrs. Adler. Thank you, Arthur. And just get out of here and go live your life. This is done. All right, Arthur. I'll... I'll miss... Nah, nah, don't start with all that. Jack, come here. Be brave, son. I'm gonna go get your mama. Mrs. Adler! Ride with me! If they're putting her on a boat, they'll probably dock at the north end of town. So I reckon we should go in the other way. Sure, I guess. I don't know. God, those goddamn bastards. Look, just follow me, okay? We're gonna get this done, Arthur. All them years. It's gonna be all right. We're gonna get Abigail out. Of course we are. Because we don't leave our own behind. That's what Dutch taught us. Well, seems his mind got changed on that idea. I remember one time, years ago, he let fly at me for robbing this house. Saying, that man was too poor. Now, taking from him was no different from the system we was fighting against. Now, he don't care who dies, 
so long as he and Maka get Whoa. rich off of it. Maka is a goddamn sickness. But, John said, Abigail knows where the money's hidden. If we can get to her in time, we might be able to get to it before they do. <coughs> Let's just get her out first. Say it. Mac, Davy, Jenny, Sean, Lenny. Oh. Now, John, we have to put an end to this. <laughs> and Eagle Flies, another angry young fool he used, just like he did with the rest of us. Like I said, Arthur, we don't need them. We're gonna make this right. Me and you together. <laughs> What's left of it. Now, come on. Ditch the horses and come up with a plan. How you feeling? I'm okay. I think you should cover me and I'll go in there and get her. Because you're the better shot, I mean. That ain't what you mean. I can still fight. I know, Arthur. But just do it my way, honey. It's for the best. Get up someplace high, like the lighthouse or something. And cover me. Please. Okay. Get Over. 
Yeah, I got you. out like gentlemen. Calm down, Mr. Morgan. That's quite a cough. Sure. Tuberculosis. I'll be dead soon. And you with me, Mr. Milton? You'll be dead, sure. But I'm gonna be just fine. We offered you a deal, Mr. Morgan. You should have taken it. I'm a fool, Mr. Milton. Well, not all you boys have quite so many scruples. Old Micah Bell. Micah? You mean Molly? Molly O'Shea. Sweated her a couple of times, never talked a word, had to let her go. Micah Bell. We picked him up when you boys came back from the Caribbean. And he's been a good boy ever since. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Using your strength, Mr. Morgan. You're still a yapping dog, Mr. Milton. Horrible man. Now come. 
Come on, both of you. Find the horses. We need to get the hell out. What happened to John? Where's John? I, I don't know. Arthur. He... What? He got killed or he got captured. No. I'm really sorry. No! Abigail, I'm, I was on the train and I didn't see it. No! Jack, he's safe. <laughs> Mrs. Adler will take you to him. But, John, I want you to know this. He loved you. He loved you, and Jack, he did. He wasn't perfect, but he did. You gotta go get that boy. Come on, get out of here. What? Arthur, what are you doing? I gotta go have a little chat. Before I get much sicker. Oh, Don't you owe Arthur me. Neither of you two. Not now. You both know. <clears throat> I gotta go settle some things. For me. No one else. You go get that boy. There'll be time for sorrow later. If you're headed back there, Arthur. Take this. I don't need it anymore. What's that? There's a chest in them caves. In the back to the left. Hidden under a wagon. Duchess chest. It's all our money. I know John told you I knew where it was. <sighs> Abigail Roberts. Always was a good thief. That you was. <laughs> Go on, get out of here. 
Get them bags packed up quick, Miss Grimshaw. Come on, all of you. Well, we're doing our best. Hurry. We ain't got long. Hurry. We just got plenty of time, Micah. Oh. We all need to have a little chat. Blacklong, you're back. Hooray. <coughs> I just saw Agent Milton, Dutch. Abigail shot him. She's okay. Not that you care too much about that, you rats. All of you. Seems old Micah was pretty close with Milton. What the hell are you talking about, Cowpoke? You talked. That's a goddamn lie. Dutch. Dutch. Think of the future. Milton told me. <laughs> and you believe him, Blacklung? You believe him? It all makes sense now. No, it damn well doesn't. Dutch, think. Dutch, be practical now. Dutch! John? You left me. You left me to die. My boy, I didn't have a choice. John, I didn't... You! I didn't have a choice. Left me! All of you, you pick your side now because this is over. All oh, them years, Dutch, for this night. <laughs> oh, be quiet, cowpoke. Be quiet. You live in the clouds. No, you be quiet, Mr. Bell, and put down your gun. There's Pinkerton's coming fast. <laughs> Now! Uh, uh, Who amongst you uh, uh, is with me? And who is betraying me? Well, I'll be in. Think, think for yourself. He's lying. He's lying. Damn it! Move! You ready, John? Yeah. Everyone cut down!
left me for dead. Seems that's what they do now. I see him. Over here. Stay with me, Arthur. Michael was the rat, John. Milton told me. <coughs> we should have killed him months ago. Come on, Arthur. With me. And the just up ahead. <laughs> I'm with you. Keep going. Hey, hold it right there. Someone killed him. Keep going. Stop where you are and put your guns on the ground. Come on. We gotta move. Arthur, you go up first. Abigail. Abigail's safe. So's Jack. Where are they? It was Sadie. The Copperhead Land. Thank you, brother. I want you to not look back. Like I said. the money. Abigail gave me the key. I head down there. I'm dead in five minutes. I got a family. That's more important. Uh, maybe you're right, but uh, you want the money? You head down. I gotta go to my family. Arthur. I'm coming with you. I'm gonna get you out of this bullshit. If it's the last goddamn thing I do. Thank you. Oh shit! Let's go! No. We need to find the higher ground! Don't worry about them! They'll just be going back for the money! We need to get the hell out of here! Get up this cliff. Yeah. Here you go. Come on, Arthur. Keep pushing. Hold up. Get behind the rock. God damn it. They're everywhere. Get out.
on, let's go. You go. Keep pushing, Arthur. No. <coughs> no. I think I've pushed all I can. Come on. You go. We ain't got time for this. Not now. We ain't both gonna make it. Go. Now. I'll hold him up. Here. Just take it. It ain't no use to me now. Ain't no more time for talk. Go. Arthur. Go to your family. Arthur! Get the hell out of here and be a goddamn man. You're my brother. I know. I know.
winning and losing. Oh. Oh. Ah. Ah. You ain't gonna reach that gun. You ain't. I'm lost, my sick friend. You lost. Yeah. Despite my best efforts to the country, it turns out I won. It's over now, Arthur. It's over. Oh, Dutch. He's right. You know it, and I know it. He's sick. He's dying. He's talking crazy. Come on, Dutch. Let's go, buddy. We made it. We won. Come on. John made it. He's the only one. The rest of us. No. I tried. In the end, I'm dead. Come on. Let's go. We can make it. Come on, Dutch. Come on! You're not better than me, Morgan. Well, you say, you fool. Damn you. Damn us both! That was close. Too close. We brought that trouble on ourselves. 
By we, you mean me. The one me who went and shot him. Seemed like he deserved shoot. I'm sure he did. But I've been thinking, ain't it about time you stop being the man making them decisions? I'm trying. Are you? I think so. I gotta find some place to lay low. Keep quiet. <sighs> Maybe Dutch was right. Maybe we should have just gone to Tahiti. Is that it with you? Tahiti or killing? Come on, John. Please, try. Try what? We gotta live somewhere for more than just a few weeks. Okay. Let's see what we can find in... in Strawberry. What do you know about Strawberry? I know they're like good, honest, hard-working men a whole lot more than angry killers. So make yourself good and honest. I'm always honest. Maybe not always good, but I'm always honest. My whole life I've been surrounded by fools with moral codes. Here's the moral code. Look out for folks. Stop trying to act like some hero in a book. What do you know about heroes and books? My reading's getting pretty good. Well, read different books, then. The books is Jack's. And, well, maybe he's doing most of the reading, but still. You're a bad influence on your mother, boy. Boy? Sorry, sir. What was that? I said you're a bad influence on your mother. Which books? Which books was that? You know, that dime novel, or Boy Calloway and the Men from the Moon, or whatever it was. I'll do my best to find better reading material, Bob. Is that what you like, then? Western tales? Boy. What's that, sir? Do you enjoy tales of the Wild West? Not so much. Anymore? I've been reading about knights. You know, of the round table. The king. What's his name? There's King Arthur, and there's Sir Lancelot, and the Lady Guinevere, and a whole lot of others. Those names. I kind of like them. You know what? So do I. Whoa, now. Strawberry, don't it? I got a good feeling about this place. Been a long time. See what kind of good work I can find. 